Kia ora whanau. This is Tiriana Tūrava speaking from Peace Within Learning on my fifth challenge of the Kahau Iteao program and my application for the scholarship for the 12 week online business training. And day five or challenge five um, was the criticism sandwich. So the sandwich of having a compliment to someone, then giving them some feedback <laughs> or some criticism, and then a compliment after that. So my learning in this challenge was um, how my nature can be that I don't want to do the um, fluffy, <laughs> don't want to do the fluffy sandwich, but I just want to go straight into the filling, per se, or as my husband put it, just go straight to the jugular. Um, or, so either do that or um, hold my tongue, not say anything, and then start resenting the situation or the person or the behavior or um that so yeah that was it was an interesting reflection on doing the challenge and getting frustrated with not wanting to do the fluffy bits um and in my point of view you know just not mucking around with with the fluff but just get straight into the hey i didn't like that um but then also recognizing that the feedback might be heard better or taken better if it's not so <laughs> straight away. Uh, and different leadership styles too. Um, some people are pretty cut straight through and then just, yeah. <laughs> um, interesting. It was really interesting. I had a lot of fun with it too, though. Um, particularly with my husband so I was able to I had his um, support in being able to practice the technique which was really good because it wouldn't have been something that I would have um, done not easily that's not the wrong word wouldn't have been something that I would choose to do um, yeah I wouldn't choose to do it as a technique um, but yeah, the reflection of it was really good. Um, so yeah, that was my <laughs> fifth day or my fifth challenge in the program. <sighs> so there's a couple more days that um, the actual challenge five um, is to be exercised. So uh, I look forward to continuing that practice and stepping outside of my, what I would do as the norm. Uh, yeah, so I want to say thank you to Te Whare Huka Huka uh, for the opportunity of doing the learning and the challenging um, so far. And I just, please, 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 uh, I hope I'm successful in being able to get the scholarship for the $7,500 worth of training. And of course, more importantly, for that whole kaupapa of supporting Indigenous people. And I really like their intention of being able to uplift society, really, at the end of the day, and being able to empower people with their lives on a daily basis through their lives in a business sense so thank you thank you everyone that supported me and commented on my posts and liked and loved hearted my posts and I would say a special thank you to my niece uh, Dana for her stepping outside of her comfort zone to start the challenge and then the flow-on effect that it's had for me to be um, 
inspired and wanting to jump on the waka as well. And then the continued flow on effect of those that I've referred with this um, program and particularly my beautiful husband. So I really look forward to the continuation of this journey. journey. Yeah. <sighs> Matewa. Thank you.